41 West Highland White Terrier Facts Every Owner Should Know Number 1. A vigorous and charming dog, the West Highland White Terrier, also known as Westie, belongs to the small-sized terrier group. They typically weigh between 13 and 20 pounds and stand 10 to 11 inches tall at the shoulders. Number 2. Characterized by their dense and thick white coat, Westies are a breed known for their predominantly white appearance. Unlike many other dogs, purebred Westies do not have a fluffy or soft coat. Number 3. Westies are also known for their perky ears, granting them excellent hearing abilities, unlike dogs with droopy ears. But did you know that Westie puppies aren't born with upright ears? Well, Westie pups are born with floppy ears, and usually, these charming ears start to stand up during their exciting first few months of life. Number 4. Their perky little ears are very sensitive, so it's a good idea to apply sunscreen to their ears or body if you plan on letting your Westie spend a lot of time in the sun. Number 5. These dogs feature short, sturdy tails deliberately bred with a strong base. Hunters designed this tail style for practicality, enabling them to safely pull the dogs out of tunnels without injuring their tails or hindquarters. Number 6. These terriers also have captivating, dark piercing eyes and a petite, carrot-shaped tail that makes their appearance simply irresistible. These endearing features, combined with their lovely personality, account for their popularity as a cherished dog breed. Number 7. According to Stanley Korn's book, The Intelligence of Dogs, West Highland White Terriers are ranked 47th out of 79 dog breed groups in terms of intelligence. They display average obedience intelligence and usually need 25 to 40 repetitions to learn new commands. They also tend to obey the first command correctly 50% of the time or better. Number 8. Often described as independent and stubborn, West Highland Whites are known among terrier breeds for their headstrong nature. These dogs can be quite selective when they choose to obey commands, doing so only when it suits their mood. Number 9. Westies, like most terriers, were originally bred for hunting, and they have an impressive natural drive for pursuing prey. These dogs will often chase after anything they perceive as prey, so it's important to keep them on a leash when they're outside to ensure their safety. Number 10. This breed's strong desire to wander and satisfy their curiosity also often leads them to run away from home, especially when they're on the hunt for rodents. To ensure their safety and well-being, it's crucial to keep them in a secure, enclosed yard. Number 11. These terriers generally coexist well with other dogs and cats, surpassing the typical terrier temperament. However, they may display a slightly bossy attitude towards other dogs of the same sex. When it comes to smaller pets like guinea pigs, hamsters, and birds, it's a good idea to avoid introducing them to SDs altogether. Number 12. Westies are ever alert, with ears perking at the faintest sound, showcasing their keen awareness. These lively dogs seem ever watchful for other animals and are not typically suited for guard duties due to their size. However, they make excellent watchdogs, readily barking to alert their owners to potential intruders. Number 13. The Westie head tilt is undeniably one of the most adorable things these dogs do. When they come across unfamiliar sounds or words, they tilt their heads to better focus on the source and hear clearly. Westies are known to perform this charming head tilt more frequently than many other breeds. Number 14. These terriers are known for being one of the chattiest terrier breeds. They tend to bark enthusiastically when they encounter new things they see or hear. Whether it's a mailman passing by or a squirrel in the yard, they'll promptly alert you to any presence around you. Number 15. The Westie also often displays a significant case of small dog syndrome. Despite their petite stature, many Westies exude a unique sense of confidence, which can sometimes lead them into challenging situations, including conflicts with much larger dogs. Number 16. Just like other terriers, West Highland Whites have a penchant for digging. They were originally bred to dive headfirst into the ground to hunt rodents, so it's common for them to create numerous holes in your yard or flower beds as they instinctively seek to wedge into the earth. Number 17. Westies are built to move underground. When burrowing to flush out game, Westies need to navigate tight spots. Their bullet-shaped bodies and thinner heart-shaped thoraxes allow them to wriggle through underground caverns in pursuit of rodents. Number 18. A generally healthy breed, the West Highland White Terrier, may still be prone to certain health concerns, as is the case with all dog breeds. According to estimates from American Breed Club, their average lifespan typically falls within the range of 12 to 16 years. Number 19. Being aware of potential health concerns is crucial for West Highland White Terrier owners. Some issues to watch out for in this breed include leg calf perthes disease, cataracts, patellar luxation, abdominal hernia, and heart diseases. Number 20. A few Westie puppies can also develop cranium and dibble osteopathy, a condition which involves abnormal bone growth in the skull and jaw, leading to discomfort and difficulty while eating. While there's no cure, anti-inflammatories and pain relievers can help manage the pain. Number 21. Another prevalent health concern for Westies is their skin problems. They're often susceptible to a heritable chronic allergic skin condition known as atopic dermatitis. Approximately a quarter of Westies surveyed are affected by this condition, which can lead to issues like red hyperpigmentation, 
lichenification, and hair loss in affected dogs. Number 22, a 2016 UK study identified the primary cause of death among this breed as pulmonary fibrosis, commonly referred to as OSD lung disease. This condition results in scarring of the supporting tissue in the air sacs and connective tissue of the lungs, causing a loss of lung elasticity that impairs the normal passage of oxygen into the blood. Number 23, originating in northwestern Scotland, Westies were initially bred as working dogs that had essential roles in clearing mines, farms, and barns of rats and other vermin. Westies were also valuable companions to hunters during fox and rabbit hunts, where their task was to flush out game from their burrows. Number 24, the term West Highland in the breed's name originates from the West Highlands of Scotland, where these dogs were initially bred in the late 1800s. They bear a resemblance to other Scottish Highland Terrier breeds such as the Dandy Denman Terrier, Sky Terrier, Cairn Terrier, and Scottish Terrier. Number 25, Edward Donald Malcolm, the 16th Laird of Poltalock, played a pivotal role in shaping the modern West Highland White Terrier. The Malcolm family initiated a breeding program focusing on dogs with light wheaten or white coat colors. This effort led to the development of a distinct terrier breed primarily known for its coat color. Number 26. The West Highland White has a variety of names from their places of origin in the British Isles. The breed had their type established in the 1800s, and in fact, Westies are called the Poltalock Terrier and then the Roseneath Terrier for a certain period. Number 27. In 1903, Malcolm expressed his desire to disassociate himself from being credited as the breed's creator and urged for a renaming of his White Terriers. The term West Highland White Terrier was first introduced in the book Otters and Otter Hunting by L.C.R. Cameron, which was published in 1908. Number 28. In 1905, Colonel Edward Malcolm founded the West Highland White Club, and just a year later, in 1906, the Kennel Club officially recognized this breed, bestowing upon them the name West Highland White Terrier. Number 29. Westies arrived in the United States in 1907 to 1908, thanks to their endeavors of Robert Golett, who imported the two West Highland Whites, Champion Kilty and Champion Rumpus Glenmore. Interestingly, during that era, they were also known as the Roseneath Terrier. Number 30. The Roseneath Terrier Club gained recognition from the American Kennel Club in 1908. However, in the following year, the club underwent a renaming and became the West Highland White Terrier Club of America. Number 31. After their introduction to the United States, West Highland Whites quickly gained popularity, leading to a surge in demand. These charming dogs captured the hearts of many, resulting in a growing number of people wanting them as their preferred canine companions. Number 32. Today, Westies maintain a strong standing as one of the favored breeds in the United States, consistently securing a position in the top 50 breeds. In 2022, the West Highland White Terrier claimed the 45th spot out of a total of 199 breeds in terms of popularity as recognized by the American Kennel Club. Number 33. West Highland Whites have excelled in dog shows on both sides of the Atlantic. Champion Morvan, owned by Colin Young, won a show championship in 1905 at just seven months old. However, since the breed was not officially recognized at the time, the championship title was not retained after re-registration as a West Highland White Terrier. Number 34. These Terriers also secured their first significant victory at the 1942 Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show, where Wolvie we'll Pattern, a Westie, won the prestigious Best in Show title. Another Westie, champion Elfenbrook Simon, repeated this achievement in 1962, further solidifying the breed's prominence. Number 35. In 1976, champion Dianthus Buttons, owned by Kath Newstead and Dorothy Taylor, earned the esteemed title of Best in Show at Crufts, the UK's premier dog show for the West Highland White Terrier breed. This achievement was later matched by another Westie named Olak Moon Pilot in 1990. Number 36. Another remarkable feat took place when a West Highland Terrier named Bernie's Jordy Girl claimed the title of Best in Show at the 2016 Crufts International Dog Show. This marked the third time a Westie had won the award since the competition's inception in 1928. Number 37. While fairly common, Westies can be quite expensive. Typically, a purebred West Highland White Terrier from a reputable breeder can cost between $1,000 and $2,500, with exceptional breed lines fetching prices well over $3,000. Number 38. These dogs have been used to create various designer breeds. Westie mixed breeds are quite common, and one of the most popular mixes is the Carolyn Terrier, closely related to Karen Terriers. Other Westie mixes include Fursch Terrier, a combination of Westie and Yorkshire Terrier, and the Bosti, a mix of Boston Terrier among others. Number 39. In the 2018 thriller Widows, directed by Stephen McQueen, a Westie named Olivia plays a significant on-screen role. The movie features an ensemble cast of A-list actors, including Viola Davis, Elizabeth Debicki, Liam Neeson, and Colin Farrell. Despite the star-studded lineup, this adorable canine actor manages to shine in the spotlight. 
Number 40. Westies have also frequently made notable appearances in the world of entertainment, including the 2003 American science fiction comedy film Good Boy, the British comedy drama TV series Jeeves and Wooster, and the Scottish mystery comedy drama series Hamish Macbeth. Number 41. These terriers have made their way into the homes of several noteworthy individuals, including Margaret Rhodes, the first cousin of the late Queen Elizabeth II of the UK, American actress and singer Scarlett Johansson, American actor and comedian Rob Schneider, and American media personality Paris Hilton, among a few others. Alright guys, now which of these Westie facts surprised you the most? Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.